Welcome to the Market Domination Talk Show. I am your host, Seth Green. I am here today with the good fortune of interviewing Adrian Rothstein, Grace Transition Specialist and CDFA at Davis Financial. Adrian, welcome to the show. Thank you very much. It is delightful to be here. We're glad to have you. What is a Transition Specialist CDFA? Okay, I am a financial planner who specializes in helping people through the major financial transitions of their life when everything is in chaos and you need to change your life, but you also need to change how you manage your money. Uh, A CDFA stands for Certified Divorce Financial Analyst, and that's someone who's been specially trained to help people when they're going through divorce. Which obviously would be one of those major chaotic life transitions. Absolutely. So why did you start working as a, C- as a certified divorced financial analyst? Well, I've done everything in financial services over a long and wonderful career. In my wealth management practice several years ago, I had three women in a row who came in. Each of them had something weird and funky on a, of a financial nature that had not been handled properly in her divorce. When the third one came in, I said, okay, I got the message. <laughs> And I realized that there was a whole group of people out there that really needed some extra help on the financial side. And at that point, I decided that that was what I wanted to do. What makes your services and you so special? Well, on the me side, I've done, as I said, literally everything in financial services before. I've been a banker and a broker and a trust officer, sales manager on the insurance side, the investment side, you name it, I've done it. And I realized that in my current practice, my clients come in and need everything because everything is changing. Your attorney in a a divorce process will obviously help you take care of the legal things and all the, the legal proceedings that are involved, and there are many of them. A therapist can help people get a hold of their feelings and manage their emotions during the process. But a CDFA like myself can help people make sense out of the finances. And, you know, we say marriage is about love, but divorce is about money. That's, I would assume, really true. I'm hoping to never have to figure that out or need your services. Um, What type of, you play a bunch of different roles in helping people through the divorce. Talk to me about those. I will. I'm sure you'll never need my services, but odds are you may know someone who will. Yes, we do. Yes. Um, I, I, as you said, I play a number of different roles. Um, I can be an advocate for someone, which means that I work for one party, often the wife, not exclusively, but mostly. And so I will help the, I will help the wife um, understand what the financial issues are. There are a lot of people out there who are very intelligent, very well educated, but they haven't managed the money in a marriage. And all of a sudden, when divorce is at your doorstep, you need to understand all of the ramifications. And it's a lot to take in, especially at a time when everything else is changing around you. So I help people get a hold of their finances, organize them. Um, I help them fill out the vast and voluminous reports that are required to give their attorneys and the rest of their team the information that's required to move forward. I kind of calm things down so that people can can be confident that they're moving forward with good information. And then once the divorce is completed, I help people rebuild financially. That is a number of roles, all of which sound really, really important. Um, I know you obviously have strict confidentiality rules about your clients, but can you tell me the types of differences you're making in your clients' lives? It is, I had no idea that it would be so fulfilling when when I began this. Um, I do play one other role, and that is as a neutral. One of the things that I try to do, I'm the president of the collaborative law group in Buffalo. Collaborative law is one of the ways that we try to help people get divorced out of court. Mediation is another of those. And in a collaborative process or in mediation, I'm a neutral. So I will sit with both parties, with both husband and wife, give them the same information, and help them come up with creative solutions for the financial aspect of their divorce that will work now and also in the future. Your attorney generally stops at the time when everybody signs on the dotted line, but that's just the beginning. Then after that, we have to be concerned with the welfare of the children moving forward, with a spouse who may have been out of the workforce for a period of time, and in developing retirement resources as well. Because what was the plan for a family together doesn't usually provide enough or may not provide enough resources the way they're set for two separate pathways. So you talked about how fulfilling it is. Yes, thank you. So uh, one client, let's call her Joanne. Um, 
uh, I thought about it and I don't have any clients whose name is Joanne. So um, in that particular case, um, I was able to help her. I, I started with her right from when she was thinking about getting a divorce. So she came in ahead of time. I helped her get all of her finances in place, get statements so that she had a full knowledge of what resources they had, what debts they had, where the assets were. And that way we were able to accomplish, working with her attorney, we were able to accomplish getting an agreement much more quickly and much less stressfully than if she had to figure all that on her own. In another case, I was, in, I was asked in to review a divorce settlement agreement that, that, was, on, that was being proposed. Um, part of what I do is a lot of the detail work. I read everything. I go through all the statements. And with my financial background, I understand what a lot of those issues are. So in working through that case, I was able to locate um, a retirement asset worth $280,000 that had been overlooked or misstated. Wow. And uh, correct an error in the settlement document, which also granted her $80,000 more than she would have had before. So. I can't guarantee that I That's can do That's probably that in every the most case. profitable proofread ever. Absolutely. A little more than a proofread yes. but getting through it. And it's a matter of bringing the financial expertise to the process. Which you've got a lot of. So enlighten us just a little bit. I know you've had decades and decades of training and experience. Just give us some highlights. Well, I'm a certified financial planner and I've been a certified financial planner since 1993. As I said, I've been a banker. I've been on the insurance side. So I'm a CFP. I have lots of letters and numbers after my name. It's a very long business card. It is. <laughs> that really mean that um, I've been fully trained in, uh, in the aspects of divorce, the financial aspects of a divorce. That's the CDFA part. CLTC is I'm certified in long-term care, which means I know a substantial amount about how to plan for those and later in life issues that often get forgotten especially when we have a lot of divorces taking place now later in life. We call them gray divorces, and it's, it's kind of a trend where... They um, wait till the kids are out of the exactly. old grown up to get divorced. Exactly. So I have that background. I've also, um, um, I'm insurance licensed and I'm a fully licensed uh, investment representative. And for those of us, for the folks out there who are watching who are in or contemplating transition and might need your calming expertise to help them rearrange their lives, what's the best way for them to get in touch with you? They can reach me uh, by phone, 716-691-8207. My website is www.transitioningfinances.com. Thanks so much for coming. Thank you. It's been a pleasure.